When choosing a handheld, you need to think about the amount of detail that you want to see at the ranges that you want to see. So the two main factors are your field of view and your level of optical magnification. As you can see here, we're looking at two horses at 65 meters. You can see the field of view effects and the level of optical magnification. The 640 cord TA62 in the top left shows the most detail, but because its chip size is much larger, you're actually getting less optical magnification. So if you have a look at the top right hand one, the TA32, that's 384 core, but it has 4.5 times optical zoom. Now optical magnification, somewhat field of view, is far more important when you're looking at something quite far away. So these are cows at 460 meters. Each model through the eyepiece, we have no trouble recognizing that they're cows. You can see shape, you can see their movement. However, you can see there's quite a vast difference in the size of the animals, which makes it easier for you to interpret from the 4.5 optical to the 640s two times. There's quite a difference. Now digital zoom can help. The 62 model having far more pixels, some 300,000 pixels versus 110,000, actually generates nice images. But all digital zoom can't be relied on. It is simply making the object bigger. You haven't got enough pixels like your phone camera to digitally enhance the photo. This affects all thermal cameras, essentially. But you can see you can make the object look bigger, which can help you interpret. You shouldn't be basing your decision on which thermal model by digital zoom.